At 6.30, we got Nevada, who went 2-10 and 10 last year. Trailer number 6, USC, who won the first game of the year last year. Uh, USC favored by 38 points on the Pac-12 network. Nate Cox for Nevada went 133-251, threw for 1,466 yards, five touchdowns, five interceptions. Obviously a really bad ratio there. Toa Tala on the ground as was their only bright side. Had 217 carries for 911 yards and 11 touchdowns. And BG Castile had 48 catches for 581 yards and four touchdowns. Caleb Williams through the air yesterday, uh, last week against San Jose State, had a crazy good game. Had went 18 to 25, threw for 278 yards, 40 touchdowns, zero interceptions. Austin Jones had six carries for five, 54 yards and two touchdowns, and Taj Washington had two catches for 85 yards and a touchdown. USC leads the series all time 5-0, ranging from 1920 to 1929. <laughs> uh, no, that was shut out three of those five times, and it was only one possession one time against USC. So I think what's going to be really interesting here is you should obviously bet the over in this game, right? <laughs> uh, like I said, I feel like, I don't remember if I was exactly right, but last year, last game, I said that USC and San Jose State, USC was going to beat San Jose State, San Jose State gets a backdoor cover, because USC's defense just isn't good enough to, like, stop offenses. They should be good enough to stop Nevada. Um... <laughs> Like, they're not good enough to stop most offenses. Nevada does not have a good offense. The reason why they went 2-10 and 10 last year, this is not a good offensive team. And also not a great defensive team. And considering that you're talking about one of, if not the best quarterback in college football, the debate right now is between Caleb Williams and Drake May. But Caleb Williams is a phenomenally great quarterback. He threw four touchdowns yesterday. He threw for 278 last week. And it went 18-25. to 25. That was a really good day for him. I'm really excited to see what Caleb Williams can do in a full season. Obviously, last year was his first full season, and he almost led USC to a playoff berth. He could definitely do it this year, considering the competition. Um, I think this game could be really good. Uh, if you want to watch USC White play some really great football and Nevada get destroyed, if you're a USC fan, this game should be phenomenal. Um, if you want to watch Caleb Williams play some phenomenal football, I wouldn't say don't turn in this game. There should be better games going on though, around the 630 mark. Um, USC is going to win this one. They're going to cover because Nevada's offense isn't good enough. I'd hit the over, by the way. Um, I'd hit the over. Whatever the over-under is, I bet that. So give me USC to win and cover here.